Hi, I'm Sweaty. I just finished my half an hour high intensity interval training and I burnt 350 calories in that half an hour. Bingo, bango. So I did the um, more advanced version of the exercises, but now I'm going to do the uh, more modified version. So that's going to appear in this little corner up here. Um, it's high intensity. That is uh, based on your own rate of perceived exertion. So you want to go to an intensity level that is hard enough for you, that you're um, consuming a lot of oxygen, you're feeling good in your muscles, but no aches and pains in your joints, you're not gasping for air. You want to get nice and sweaty like this and get this cool um, pelvic bone <laughs> imprint on your shirt. That's what we're going for. Great. So. Um, Enjoy class. It is a Zoom class, so the link to our class is below. So you're going to hear me saying people's names. You might even see some of my students pop up on the camera. Okay? So without further ado, enjoy this class. And, uh, yeah. Like and subscribe. Good. And so marching. Nice. Two-minute warm-up. Good. Marching, you're going to march wide. Between. Good. So here's your feet. Jump, feet, jump. Nice. When you land, I want you to pull the muscles in. Inner thighs. Good. Inner foot. Nice. Looking good. Practice safe jumping and landing. Springing up, good, and springing down with control. Perfect, guys, hang in there. Growing tired. Last stretch, dig deep. Beautiful, inline skaters. So we jump to the right, we jump to the left. You can touch 
your foot. And away we go. Good, make it all about balance. Whoop. Elegant. Nice. Outstretch your arms to create a more stable, balanced environment. Good. Reach your foot out. Land softly, toe ball heel. And then squeeze your inner thighs. Squeeze your glutes. Extend your spine. Good, lots going on. Nice. Keep going. Two more seconds. Beautiful, perfect. So we're gonna take a big hop forward and then shuffle back. So we're going for that long jump. So big jump, shuffle back. Good. Try to jump. Woo. Far. And run back. Keep going. Seventeen more seconds. Landing softly. Hustling back. Ooh. Ooh. Nice. Woo. One more second. <laughs> nice. Okay. So now burpees. Take it or leave it. You all. Good. And down. Good. Push up is optional. Maybe you jump up. Good. If you don't want to do the burpee, just do a basic um, squat, right? Or a jumping squat. My jump was just so limpy. There. <laughs> Try not to get limpy on this. Especially that jump up. Wait. You can try to touch the ceiling. We. Good. Home stretch. Nice. Boy. That went down super easy. Great. So, perfect. 35 second break. We're right on target. Everything was simple, elegant, yet challenging. So we're gonna do the same thing one more time. Starting from the squat jacks. And to make it a little bit more challenging, you can stay low. Instead of jumping up, you can stay low. Okay, here we go. Three more seconds. Off to the races. Good. So it will look like this. Good. Staying low. Really burning out those thigh muscles. Good. Poke your booty back. Lengthen your waistline. Elevate the chest. Good. Chin lifted. Good. The lactic acid is going to pick up. Good. But stay low. Stay with it. Quick. Good, quick, quick. Awesome, guys. Six more seconds. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Jumping lunges. You can take the middle beat out. So that would mean splits, splits. Ooh. And go. And go for. A high jump in between. Good. Landing Ooh, softly. Bending your knees, ankles, keeping your chest lifted. The shock is absorbed in your muscles. It doesn't reverberate into your bones. Good. Four seconds. Whoa. 
<sighs> in line skaters. It's all about balance. Good. So kick. Good. Land kick. Land kick. Touch your laces maybe to make it a little harder. But make sure you keep your inner foot suction to the ground. Excellent, guys. Keep it going. Awesome. All you got. Big leap. Lower down with control. Nice. So we have that big long jump. To make this hop harder, hop back. So long jump, pop two, three. Long jump, one, two, three. Good. Be careful with the backwards hops here. Nice, have a spot marked, jump to it. Good, return to your start. Good. Good. You wanna really oof, decrease your response time. Increase your time in the air. Good. Almost there. Great. Burpees. Remember, burpees, totally optional. Squats will do the same trick. And down you go. <clears throat> Push up optional. Jump like you mean it. Jump to your feet. Woo. Good. Don't phone it in. Hang in there. Keep your breathing smooth, control. Whew. Almost there. Long stretch, three seconds. Beautiful. Awesome. That's our second break. Have a sip of water, looking good. Looking good. Hmm. That second set took it out of me. Woo, okay. So, if you elevated everything on the second set, just do everything again in the more difficult uh, variation. Or if you want to dial it back down to it, something easier. Good. And here we go. I'm staying low. Good. You're going to go a little deeper each time you jump in and out. Good. Just a little deeper. Put those muscles to fire. You got your quads, your hamstrings. Good. Your glutes. You got your spinal erectors keeping your chest open. Pulling your abs in. Good. Free up some space for movement. Nice. All you got. 10 more seconds. Home stretch. Lunges. Okay. Feel free to add that beat in the middle. Feet in the middle Ooh, really helps. Or switch, switch for more advanced. Can you keep your arms up? You can reach your arms over your head to make this more challenging. Can you keep your hands on your hips. I like to keep my hands on the, my hips. Just make sure my hips stay even. Good. One level. Ooh. Why is today so hard? Oh. Keep going. 
fora. Vamos mostrar a forma, Marcelo. Inline skaters. So, you're gonna balance before you kick. Good. And once you have that, then take the bow. Make sure your chest, it stays open. Good. Nice. You can go faster or slower than me. Try to look off in the horizon at a balance point. Good job, guys. Finish strong. Seven more seconds. Big leaps, big leaps. Nice. Speaking of big leaps, we're gonna get the world record for jumping in your living room. Great, and go. Nice, you can shuffle back or hop back. Good. Big leap, three hops back. Keep going. Oh, find your target repeatedly. Good. Hit it. Keeping your balance. Awesome. Option to do a basic squat. Great, down. Good. Keep it going. All you got. that jump. Push up optional. Six more seconds. Mm. Boom. Yay! <laughs> Thumbs up. All right. Take a lap. Have a sip of water. Whew. We have 35 seconds until we get into Corville. So, our core is simple as well. We're gonna start off, we're gonna start off with those assisted sit-ups. So if you have a table or chair you can put your feet under, or maybe you have a heavier weight, right? Or a weighted blanket or something that's gonna be heavy and provide you with a little assistance. So we're gonna go for hands behind your head and go. Oof. Good. Keeping your abs good. Extended, right? We're not going into a crunch. We're working on your core. But at the very end, there's a little bit of a tuck curl. And you can even take that out and make it into an extension. Good. If you want to, you put your arms in front of you and make it easier. Eight more seconds. Great. Next one, we're in a plank. We're gonna do um, mountain climbers. We'll do twisted mountain climbers. So you'll go opposite, opposite. Good. And you go for speed. As if you're running up a hill, you can go slow. That works as well. Great. Keep going. Abs in tight. Nice. Chest open. Shoulders broad. Beautiful. 
15 more seconds. Home stretch. And relax. Good on your back again. We're gonna do V-ups now. So V-ups are a lot like those sit-ups, but your legs come as well. And you can bend your knees. Good, down and up. Down, up. Good. Tune into your core muscles. Let them help you up. Crunch your abdominals. Your knees can bend. Totally fine. You could always just do a crunch, right? You don't have to go into such extremes. Or you keep one leg down, right? And alternate. Great, the next one, leg lifts. So hands under your butt. You're gonna lift your legs to the ceiling. Great. We're gonna do a jackknife, so lower your legs down, lift up, curl up. Good. So peel yourself up and lower down. To make this a little easier, pike your feet over your head and roll yourself down. Keep your arms under your hips to guide your um, back onto the mat and to keep your core in as your legs lower down. Nice, keep going. Three more. Last one. Nice. Ooh. And relax. Good. So we're going to do that one more time. 35 more seconds. Awesome. So we'll start with those assisted sit-ups. If you don't have any assistance, it's fine. You can do it with your feet on the ground. It's gonna be a little harder, but it's not undoable. Or not undoable? Not not doable. It is doable, how about that? So nuzzle your feet under something. Maybe it's a heavy blanket. It could be a sofa or an ottoman. Good. Hands at your clavicle to make it easier. Hands behind your head to make it harder. Elbows wide makes it even harder. Good. Nice. You can round your spine when you come up or you can go into a back extension when you come up. Mid back extension, so not a low back extension, but <sighs> keep going. <sighs> nice work, guys. Great. So we have that plank with the twisted mountain climbers. I'm really slow at this, so if you can go faster than me, don't hold back. Don't think that I'm doing this quickly. I'm actually, oh, really bad at this, which is why I keep throwing it in. For a while I was avoiding it because I was so bad at it, but that's the wrong attitude. The more you do something, the more you get better at it. So. Be prepared for me to throw in more and more things that I'm awful at. <laughs> Good, keep going. Dig a little deeper for the last 12 seconds. Perfect. On your back, V ups. So your legs can stay on the ground, right? You can stay bent. And you can just do crunches. Or you lift everything. Some things to work, look out for. If your hips and back hurt, oof, bend your knees a little bit more. 
pull your core a little tighter. You should be able to set your legs super softly down on the ground. onto the mat, belly button to slide, start by lowering your legs, lift, jackknife. Feel free to pike your feet over your head, good, or maybe just go a little smaller, good, keep going, nice, eighteen more seconds. More seconds, and then we have our isometric hold. Mm. Nice. So you get a full break. We have 40 seconds until we're doing our isometric hold. So you can choose to um, do a headstand, a handstand. Uh, we have go team, <laughs> yay! Um, and then we also have. Um, planks and wall sits. So I think Kathleen is gonna do a, an inversion. So go ahead and get started in your inversion if you want to. And the rest of us, we can chill out for like 12 more seconds. I guess I'll do a plank so I can get better and better at doing planks. Oh, and I'll do an elbow plank because, oops, time starts now. I'm gonna do an elbow plank because they're more challenging for me. What I have, what I tend to do is either load my black back or my shoulders. Once I stop loading my shoulders, I load my back and I just keep exchanging between the two. So I want to feel myself getting stronger in my core. I'm lifting out of my armpits and open in my body. Great. Awesome. If you're in a plank, lift your left leg for a while. Nice. Squeeze your belly button, everybody. Good. If you're in a plank, switch legs. Good, keep tightening the corset around your waist and reaching your heels a little further away. Your heart is open and your neck is long. Good, both feet down if you're in a plank. Good, extending your legs long, squeezing all the muscles to the bone. Good. 15 more seconds, we've already done a minute. Nice. Ooh, relaxing your back, make sure your back isn't taking the brunt of the work. And relax. Good, press back to a child's pose and just hang out. Good, Kathleen, or anybody in inver inversions, you'll take some time to look to the right and look to the left. And just let your neck return back to normal. The rest of y'all, let's lift up to our feet. And let's start marching again. Just like how we started class, marching. Good. And in that march, you're gonna start to pick up your knees just a little bit more. Good. And reach your arms over your head. Good, and let your arms down. Good, one more time, reach up over your head. Good, and exhale down. Nice and wide. We're gonna go into some squats. So sinking down and up. You're super warm, so your squat should be nice and deep. So let's do seven more. Good, six. Nice, five. Keeping your chest open. Four more. Three. Two. Last one, good. We're gonna go down fast and up slow. So we're gonna go down in a one count and up, two, three, four. Down, up, two, three, four. Down, up, two, three, four. Down, up, two, three, 
four. Good, two more just like this. Now let's reverse it. Down, two, three, four, up. Down, two, three, four, up. Down, two, three, four, up. Good, six more. Down, two, three, four, up. Good. Down, two, three, four, up. Good, Down, two, three, four, up. Good. three more. Up. Oof. Last one. Good. Sinking nice and low, elbows to the knees, straighten and bend. Good, 10. Good, try to extend your legs all the way. Eight more. Pushing in on the elbows, pushing out on the knees. Good, six more. Great, five. Perfect, four. Three more. Great. Two. Last one. And all the way up. Great job. Shake it out. Good. Let's grab your uh, ankle. Stretch open your hip and knee. Lean forward, getting a little deeper into that uh, hip joint. Great. And then we'll switch. Beautiful. Oh, and relax. Nice job, guys. Bye.